<clears throat> so we're back again. I'm kind of pinging around here. We could do some trunks. Trunks is fun. Yeah. Yeah. Kefla maybe? I don't know. Kula maybe? I don't know. Bardock maybe? I love Piccolo, I love his moves, I'm not sure if I'm good at like getting those moves to work in the game, but it'd be fun to play. I'm gonna hit you with everything I got. So I play a little bit of like Hit, Beerus, Cooler, I understand those characters and I like kind of like playing them. Uh, Bardock and Ultra Instinct Goku is pretty good fun, but be honest, I can go around the whole roster, kind of do some of their stuff, do all their special and shit. I mean, that's not the hard thing, is it? Gonna do the long one today. It's not random, so it's actually going to take me less time because the difficulty on this isn't as hard. Father, thanks for training with me. Got some rare colors for these people. <laughs> I say rare. I got some color for these people. So, let's get started. Ready? Go! He pulled his own son a bastard. So I'm just kind of practicing for the moment, trying to remember Trunks' stuff, because he's got some stuff, but it always felt like they could have done more with the character, you know? I felt that up, but that's okay. I'm just trying to remember everything. I'm trying to remember his move where he flips in the air and shit. I if they were trying with go tanks, he would have been doing a lot more screen filling shears. He would just kind of stood there, so it wasn't really a match. I don't get this guy at all. Drops. Win. That's all for now. Thanks. The ranking system's dumb, it's basically just on how much health you have left at the end of it is just a huge deciding factor. If you lose a character, you're basically going to get a really bad grade. <laughs> I doubt it'll be hard because it's just stage two, so. Yeah, that, that move's pretty unsafe if you land it and he blocks it, you know, the, the sword move. Where he, he says, I'm coming. I 
kind of lost where I was there a second. Got some Piccolos. Normally you don't let themselves get hit by that orb, it's just a distract. But okay. Oh, well, I, I deserve that. <laughs> Let's just stand here and block each other, that's entertaining. <laughs> yeah, way too close for the Hell Zone Grenade. He wasn't trying to evade, so I just like Hell Zone Grenade. And now just watch me wreck with fucking Kale, uh, Kefna. Like, Kef was just so fast. Put me and Kale together, and what do you get? The strongest Saiyans around! Kefla! Win! You Universe 7 guys ain't half bad, you know? I mean, Universe 6 has to be, but still! So annoying. It's annoying because I really want to like Kefla and I really want to like the Universe 6 characters and then they just do their best to fucking piss you off with them because they're supposed to be rival characters and you're like... <sighs> Get ready for battle. You can see why a lot of like Dragon Ball like obsessed people were like oh I fucking hate them because they seem to trivialize a lot of stuff and just go yeah we're better than you fuck you and like you know People don't like to hear Goku not the strongerest. But whatever. It's not like Kef is stronger. <laughs> it's not. Like... I'm just gonna say that her projectiles are pretty weak when they're outside of her super, you know? She just fast and has lots of combo potential, but it's just like... Visually, it's not the most en the most exciting. <laughs> Point blank projectile supers. The AI loves using that move of Android 18. Time to die. <laughs> She got light grenaded the fuck up. It's Krillin. Yeah, shouldn't have done that move. <laughs> yeah. I can't get her to work ever. So I'm never really jumping first and then grabbing, so it's just a bit weird. He could do with an air projectile, that's why I press X in the air, because I think, oh shit, I'm up in the air and they're out of range, I'll press X for a projectile and he just kind of extends his arm. <laughs> no matter what universe they're from. Saiyans always seem to strive to better themselves and achieve more power. Thanks to the commentary, Pico is turning into the Morgan Freeman of like 
the drag point here that I was just explaining for the viewer what's happening. Standing around going, what? He's doing this. It's like, yes, thanks, Piccolo. Remember when Piccolo used to do stuff? I know. <laughs> You really need to give Piccolo more stuff to do in the animes. You're dead, Cell. Cell will be dead. Hmm. Trunks, make sure you don't disappoint me. Shut up, Cell. <laughs> Are you, ready? you have a turtle penis for a head. No. I mean, you say whiffed supers, and then like the AI just likes to do like from full screen small area of effect supers. <laughs> okay, yeah. To be fair, I was just kind of slapping him in the head there. Thanks for the endless blocking, Dick. <laughs> Blocks everything. What the dick? It's time for Frieza. He really likes that move. To be fair, it's a pretty good move to okay? take. Yes, Mrs. East behind me. Damn it! <laughs> Fucking Kid Boo. I hate Kid Boo in this. Kid Boo is a pain because I always misread that as a projectile, and then it's always a throw. It does a lot of damage to Kid Boo as well, I don't like that. This shit. This shit right here. I hate that fucking move, I always misread it. Poop. Cause it's a purple ball floating forwards, I always read it as uh, being a projectile so I block and then it it's like has the properties of a throw and it fucks me every time. Shut up, Kid Boo. Uh, I've got a special realm of hatred for a lot of the child sized characters in this game. They're just really annoying to fight. They're not even like it's about hitbox, they're just annoying. Should I learn Cell? I love playing Frieza. I really had great fun learning Frieza's stuff, and he has some really neat stuff. I'll probably show him in a video at some point. He's pretty good fun. Oh, 
You could tell he was trying to add pressure so that was just a flat block to stop him. Haha, <laughs> slight shin kick. Fuck you. I have to deal with my, my nemesis. Here he goes doing his fucking bullshit. <laughs> Everyone else has stuff. Kid Boo is just bullshit and I don't care. Oh, it didn't kill. Kick him in the nods. That was shut up. Piccolo win. No matter what universe. No. Sam's always seen. Jeez, man. Piccolo and his observations there. Now, Android 16 has a lot of damage potential if you let him throw you around a few times, which, yeah. See? So you really want to get him off the screen as quickly as possible, but you also just want to avoid all of his crazy throws, but he has a big range on a lot of them. He's fun to play, but yeah. That's basically what you want to do, get him away as soon as possible. Managed to get both of them there. You know when... You can tell when the AI just wants Tien to just massacre you, and that's when they start tri beaming into Shin tri beam. Or. Kiko Ho. Look at that damage. I hate it when people just block your level 3, it's like, can you just... Fine, I should be doing it better right now, I should actually be comboing into shit. Look at this block level. <laughs> Fucking god damn to him. <laughs> Yeah, it's just raw special beam cannons. Isn't this the second TM we fought? Yeah, I kind of deserve that. <laughs> like, You'll notice that every entrance I'm just like throwing a level 1 super out like, fuck it, why not? When will we get Trunks Blue?
I mean, that'd be neat. I mean, in anything, manga, anime, whatever. Not just, you know, this game. But also this game. Just took that big bang attack to the face like an idiot. Yeah, this isn't going well for me. Oh, that's a little better. Just keep rushing him down. <laughs> Well, we just crossed each other up by doing a Yeah, that didn't work. Bad decision there. That super is very often like the hell zone grenade, the bad decision, unless you're anti airing or something. I was hoping I'd do more damage, but it's okay. I followed it up. Ah, oh, you recovered. Yeah, I forgot she had an air super, so I do it twice. <laughs> Fun fact, Kefla has an air super, Piccolo and Trunks don't. <laughs> They need more wing quotes, holy shit. <laughs> yeah, same match, but get rid of the trunks and put Beerus in the way instead. <laughs> Look at that damage. That's basically Goku says no. <laughs> Goku says no super. I was like the amount of damage I did to Goku, right? The amount of damage I did and he was just like, fuck this Kaioken. <laughs> and he just said, Wow, true to the anime that I see. That was, that was pretty good. I should have followed that up with the light instead of the heavy, like, chop, but it's fine. Yeah, I moved, I, yeah. I tanked in the wrong person, Max, and I do that a lot in team games. Yeah, 
<laughs> We're just throwing massive OP beam supers at each other. I think I pulled this out by accident. Oh jeez. Just kind of tries to do the same thing twice. Look at this like hell nope thing. I was just gonna get him with my level three, and he just goes, Hakai. <laughs> like, oh. <laughs> I don't feel like fighting anymore. <laughs> I love that. You know, you know, oh, you knocked out my character. Oh. We know Piccolo. We know. I really need to stop the bad habit of like, oh, my character's landed in the match okay straight away a level one super or like whatever just for a projectile super that's really bad habit to get into with the AI <laughs>